The Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta is over after an unexpected two-day extension and players are starting to process their thoughts. Folks who pre-ordered the game got to spend as much as a week blasting droids or clone troopers on Naboo and playing X-Wing vs. TIE Fighter. I've collected some of the player consensus here, but keep in mind that this is all pulled from a beta any and all details are subject to change by the time the full game arrives. People are worried about loot box progression all of the gear and customization options in the Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta were unlocked via loot boxes or by spending scrap which you earn from loot boxes new emotes, new guns, new ability customizing star cards, they all came from the same virtual containers of random goodies. Some players are concerned that this will make the full game feel unrewarding for folks who don't want to shell out real money. Click on any of these images to see the full source. I brought up the TLDR for brevity's sake, they had a lot to say for going skillful progression in exchange for cash progression. The flat rate progression is shameful and balanced toward pay to win. Not on October 11, 2017 but they like Starfighter Assault Mode feeling seemed fairly positive about Battlefront 2's standard infantry combat though they aren't really glowing compared to the last game. But Starfighter Assault Mode has emerged as a surprise favorite. Here's hoping there's a lot more space combat where this came from really starting to love Starfighter Assault, so different but so damn good Star Wars Battlefront I beta picked out Twitter.com Silks for new October 7, 2017 I may have stayed up till 2am playing the Battlefront 2 beta send help wait no send help after I've played more Starfighter Assault October 5, 2017 and who dose in love droids. Star Wars ISNT Star Wars without comic relief robots. Is it weird that I'd rather use a rocket droid over Boba Fett in Battlefront the October 11, 2017 even with the extension, a lot of people think it ended too soon this has to be a good sign, at least. The AD Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta is over, now what am I meant to do for a month? October 11, 2017 Battlefront 2 beta is finally over. Needing to wait a month for the launch is gonna be hard. Pa October 11, 2017 just got past the user agreement only to find out the Battlefront 2 beta has ended. Person face palming, light skin tone mail, sign October 11, 2017. There's a lot more talk about Star Wars Battlefront 2 out there, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. The full game won't be out until November 17th.